Happy Holidays! Gang, it's your girl Maya. And it's your boy Danny here. And we are back with another MD Takeover video. Yes, we would like to welcome you guys to the first episode of our holiday special. From yes. our family to yours, by the time y'all get this video, it will be Thanksgiving Day. So we wish y'all a happy Thanksgiving from our family to yours. And we welcome you to the first episode of our holiday special. So sis, tell them what we're doing. So today for the first episode of the holiday special, we're gonna be baking a sweet potato pie. Mm. Then you will do the honors of baking it. Cause she can't bake. We ain't gonna talk. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, so we about to get started. We've already done a little bit of prepping. Mm. Um, the potatoes, the sweet potatoes have already gone into the oven. They mm -hmm. just need to be peeled and Period. mixed and everything like that. So we're gonna go ahead and get into this video. But before we get into it, make sure you stop what you're doing. Like this video, comment down below. Hit the subscribe button if you're new to our channel. We welcome you to the Takeover Gang. We have new content for y'all every Tuesday and Thursday. And since it's the holidays, we may have a little extra special content for y'all. And make sure you subscribe because you don't want to miss this holiday special. We're going to be doing recipes, trying all kinds of holiday foods and things that you guys don't want to miss. Yo, all right. Let's get into it. Per. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, so we're, the first step, you want to go ahead and preheat your oven. We're going to preheat our oven to a standard 3 of 50. And got the, the oven light on, too, because I, I, for some reason, I can't bake without my oven light on. You just don't. Right. When I be trying to uh, Right, so here we have our sweet potatoes. So the sweet potatoes have already baked. For this recipe, I generally use um, eight small sweet potatoes, but yeah, the people still had a sale and it was 50 cent for a bag, so you know I got the bag and it had nine in there, so I just threw the, the nine one in That's there. a good deal, too. Uh, that's, that's what I'm telling I just love a good deal. So I just went ahead, this was the ninth one, so I said it's so small, I just went ahead and threw it in there. And you know, if you got a little extra, I'll show you what you do if you got a little extra. Mm -hmm. um, so I baked these uh, in the oven, you'll see the footage, I baked these in the oven at 350 degrees for about an hour, hour, 10 minutes, maybe an hour, 15, depending on how big your potatoes are. Um, some people boil them, but that's ghetto in my opinion. My mama ain't, that's, that's not that what she, my mama taught me. No, you know, you, this, this the holidays, you can't be experimenting. I feel like that just takes flavor. So we're going to come on over here yonder. Um, we Over here yonder. I sounded so old. So we're going to go ahead and peel these potatoes. Mm -hmm. uh, yes, Lord. Make sure your potatoes cool, because I don't have time to be sitting there, uh, getting hands burnt. Um, and see, this is how you know your potatoes done. For one, you need to do a little test and squeeze them or either stick a fork or a little knife in there. <laughs> Y'all ain't see that. Um, and then the skin come right off. Bella, you can't have this, baby. This is not for you. She just knows, tell just the way. She right. just knows she finna get some. Throw that L. Uh, hey. Oh, throw that L. Like, you better. Throw that, that L. Like <laughs> All right, Jocelyn. <laughs> Y'all, look, give me a second, and I'm a, this girl. She gonna say that. But was so polite when she thinks she finna get something. Right. Uh, uh, it's the manners for me. Bella. <laughs> <laughs> That girl just threw shit up to get something. Sit down, Bella. Siéntate. 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 Buen trabajo, mama. Bella, Bella bilingual, y'all. For y'all, man. Um, but y'all, give me a second. I'm going to peel these potatoes, and I'm going to be back with y'all, and I'm going to show, show y'all what we're going to do. We're going to be back. We're going to be back. 
All right, you guys, so we're back. I peeled off nine of the sweet potatoes. We got that there. So we got um, my little hand blender. She don't have a name. She need a name. What's her name? Hammy, Hammy, her name is Hammy. 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 Okay, what you was gonna say? Belinda. <laughs> I liked it. Oh. oh. <laughs> no, Belinda gonna be the name of the blender. Or the, or the, oh. the ninja. Okay. Now okay. make sure you got your uh, your whisks, your whisks secured, there, baby. Hammy, just she just let it go. So with this, um, I'm gonna use the hand mixer to. Uh, to mix up these sweet potatoes, because you gotta make sure you mix them up well, baby. Because if you don't mix your sweet potatoes up well, they're gonna be stringy, and don't nobody want no stringy sweet potato pie, because that's nasty. Y'all really? need to stop making that nasty holiday food. You hear me? Anyway, tangent over. So I'm going on a mix. It's gonna get a little loud, so I'm gonna shut up. One minute, 37 seconds later. Now look at that, and I see we're working with a little something. Mm -hmm. Got me a little spatula so you can scrape them sides. And but please make sure, like I said, please make sure that you um that you blend your sweet potato well because ugh. anyway. Like a stringy potato. Mm -hmm. And don't. Um, plus these potatoes, they don't look stringy. Um just just naturally because generally the sweet potatoes you gotta blend the little strings out. But we're gonna go ahead and mix this in here. Also, this is my mother's recipe that my mother taught me. I ain't asked her for permission, so mama when you watch this video. Anyway, um, so to this, I'm gonna add some melted butter. I generally use a half a stick of butter. I have a little bit more than that, just because like I said, I have those nine potatoes. So I'm gonna go ahead and add my butter in here. And I'm the type of person, I like to blend all my ingredients in separately, just because it's just, I feel like it just add an extra step of love. You got more, you know? gonna add an egg. Baby, make sure you crack your egg in a separate bowl. You don't want to ruin all of that goodness. In case you got a bad egg. <laughs> you give it a little uh a little whisk if you will. Mm -hmm. and get that into there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Baby you bought that so make sure you get all of that all of that egg. <laughs> Blender up. That's what, you call a, that's what you call a wet ingredient. Then after that, so we added one egg. Now here I have a cup and a half of sugar. I'm just gonna add this poco a poco. I'm gonna add it bit by bit. Little by little. Mm -hmm. Some of that, uh, some of that power in a flying. Surprise, mm -hmm. Bella ain't go after it. She, when you said flying, her head went the moving though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so that was a cup and a half of white sugar. After that, I have a half a cup of ground sugar packed tightly. Also, this is one indicator of a good sweet potato pie. Baby, this is why I can't eat patty pie. This, I can't do it, because baby, I can look at patty pie and tell her pie don't it's have too no light. brown sugar in it. It is too light. I need that pie once it come out the oven to almost be my complexion. I'm, I'm a little too far, but I need it to almost be my complexion. I need a little color, it's a little melanin in that pie, but I'm going to go on and add. <laughs> <laughs> Child, that sugar was just holding on, but I'm going on. on. All right. Let me just scrape them sides. Mm -hmm. That looks nice already. Mm -hmm. So do you find that um, blending in your ingredients separately, that also helps with getting the strings out as well? Yeah, I mean, yeah, because I mean, it's being blended more. I mean, with potatoes, the sweet potatoes, I don't feel like you have to worry about over blending like it would, if it was bread or something, because you know, if it's bread and cake, you can over blend it. But um, yeah, I feel like it, it can. I mean, I guess you don't have to. That's just the way I've, I've always done it. I mean, you can also look, tell by the string, and it's like you can look at this, for instance, like look down here, like that's a little stringy, but the majority of it is 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 creamy. Like it got a little spikes, you know, but it's not overly 
stringy. If it was overly stringy, the whole thing would look like like that down there. Just a little tidbit of wisdom. Mm -hmm. Now we got our, uh, our spices. So I have two teaspoons of cinnamon. I have a, 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 a half a teaspoon of allspice and a half a teaspoon of nutmeg. So I'm just gonna go on and put that in there. I, I usually don't do that much, but like I said, I got a little bit extra here. So I'm trying to get all of that up off there. You feel me? Cause that's goodness and sabor and flavor. You can also see the difference in color in that too. And then what's gonna take it right on home Vivid at pure vanilla extract, and then I think if I'm if I'm correct, or I might not be correct. <laughs> no, I'm correct. It's a with Madagascar vanilla beans. I don't, I don't know. I don't know how they compare to the rest of the world vanilla beans, but it just, it just makes it feel special. Cause you know when we when we was uh, when we was cheering, they had that that, that series of movies, the, the Madagascar. Mm -hmm, them, them ones. So what um, got to do with vanilla? Cause it's the Madagascar vanilla beans. Anyway, so I'm gonna add in uh, two teaspoons of this here vanilla, baby. And if it overflow, just just let it overflow. My cup running over. Oh, oh, and this stuff expensive. Oh well. Damn, I sat down wasted. A good vanilla uh, from Madagascar. How you feel? The Lord will provide. Mm -hmm. That's what happens when your blessings overflow. Ha! Ta ta ta. I have felt that down in my bosom. Which one? The left one or the right one? Both of them. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. I said hi. Double portion for your troubles. <laughs> we know you got a double portion. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you don't talk to me, bro. Yes, Lord. Oh, Lord. All right, y'all. Yeah. Anyway, back to this pie. So I'm mixing that vanilla. Mm -hmm. And I'm just gonna fold it. And TBH, y'all, that's it. All you gotta do is just taste it to make sure your, um, your, you know, your flavors are right. Make sure you have enough sugar and stuff like that. The, uh, I guess the unfortunate thing about baking pies with potatoes and stuff like that is that um, your potatoes are never going to be the exact size that's why we go by like number of potatoes, but it, it still can be thrown off a little bit. So I'm gonna taste this. Look at this one down here. Searching for the potatoes. She don't, even, she don't even like sweet potato like that. Mm. It's not bad, but it needs a more sugar. It's like a... It needs more sugar and some more mm -hmm. vanilla. A little more cinnamon. That vanilla that you waste. This girl is really pressed. She don't even do that with chicken. I'm gonna add a little more vanilla. Bella be thinking everything for her. A little more cinnamon. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna. I'm gonna add a little more spicy. A little more pinch. A little more pinch. How I sound. Can I borrow a cup of sugar? We just got sugar. <laughs> we had it for a couple months. Because <laughs> we rarely use sugar. Right. I don't know why I chose to fold this in versus blending it. But... Mm, it is what it is. Uh -huh. And look, y'all, look. I'm making this pie from scratch, but I ain't making no pie crust, baby. I bought them the good Pillsbury from the store, mm -hmm. and child, didn't money funny. I don't even buy the Pillsbury. I buy the off brand. <laughs> Cause okay, sure. hot, you there? You gotta do what you gotta do. Period. Now, 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 listen. Don't listen. be like Young Barbecue. Who was Young Barbecue? And go get that patty pie and take it out the box. <laughs> And put fall over it, baby. If you need a, if you need to make a sweet potato pie, please follow this recipe. Okay. And bring something good to the family function. And child, if y'all paying right, I'll make it for you. Mm -hmm. How you doing? <laughs> mm. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Hold yeah, on. That's good. That's good. Mm-hmm. That's, that's the one. That's the three and the mm-hmm. four. I forgot mm-hmm. two, but that's it too. Mm. Oh, yes. Gotta be this is my favorite. Outside of my mama pound cake. Mm. My favorite dessert. For the holiday. Child, you have to have a second look. I have a second. I opened the freezer and I ain't see the uh, I ain't I ain't see the pasta. I thought I was gonna have to run back to the stove. Yeah, we just went grocery shopping, boy. That freezer is packed. <sighs> to um, the nine. And so is the stove. That's what, mm-mm. baby. Do your holiday shopping early. Do you hear me? Mm-hmm. Go on and get that done. Cause Lord, them people will, them people will be there. Okay. Like I said, Pillsbury, you are gonna have the regular pie crust. You don't need the deep dish. I'm just gonna do the regular. Come with two in there. Mm-hmm. And this recipe is for two pies, correct? Mm-hmm. Sometimes we have a little overflow, but I'd rather have a little overflow, because baby, look, one thing, don't come to nobody function and your pie shell is halfway full. <laughs> I don't want that. I would rather you come with one pie that's overflowing than two pies and they look like you got more crust than you got uh, pie filling. Baby, don't do that, because what you, what you don't know is when you leave, the people gonna talk about you. And what we don't want is people to talk about you in your holiday food. And depending on what kind leave. of family you got, they probably talked about you to, to your, your family. Because <laughs> that's the kind of family that we got. Yeah, right, because ain't nothing worse than, than somebody go to the dessert table and be like, oh, who made the sweet potato pie? <laughs> yeah. I want them to say, oh, who made the sweet potato pie? All right. So uh, I just like to do it, uh, you know, one by mm-hmm. one. Mm-hmm. Just scoop by scoop. Mm-hmm. 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 Like it's gonna be just enough. Mm-hmm. Cause I was gonna say, if you ever have overflow, you can just take it and maybe thin it down a little bit and then bake it and make you a sweet potato casserole. Which that's my specialty. It's basically the same thing. All you gotta do is just have it's a just little- just toppings a little bit. Right, and you make it, you add a little apple juice and thin it. And look, you get, you see that bowl? I don't want that bowl to go in that, in that sink like that, baby. You better get, you paid for this. This was 50 cent worth of potato. I'm going to get every last 50 of <laughs> every cent. Because right now, they still got one cent worth of potato up in there. Shoot. I'm weak. Tell them I'm going to get every cent of this I am still amazed at that bag being 50 cent. I ain't never seen a bag of potatoes. And mama going to talk about some. And mama going to talk about some. Something must be wrong with that potato. I said, girl, for 50 cent. Shoot. I'm going to find out. Potatoes. It tastes good to me. Right. Hmm. I forgot where they said they were from, but the package was in Spanish. That's probably why I caught That's my attention. That's probably why. Especially because the prices of everything has gone up, you know, this year with COVID. So what you're gonna do is just you're gonna smooth that pie out. You know, you just gotta. I may have to get my other spatula because it'll it'll smooth it out a little bit better. But they were just going and smooth it out. Go on and get it to all them edges. You don't want no 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 nooks, no crevices, no crannies. And no grannies. What else you got against grannies? Nope, they're not lovely. <clears throat> mm. Let me get my other side. <clears throat> you ain't giving what needs to be gave. Okay. But you know I'm just <laughs> Sure this patch is so, so what's the difference but one's flatter mm-hmm. this is a scoop spatula. I don't know then you got something for everything it's, and do because what I hate to what I hate to be doing is cooking something and then I don't have I'd rather have something and not need it than need it than I have it okay mm-hmm. you're telling me you know we got such and such I'd be like child when did you buy that child she don't even know what it's called no just learn how to use some of these utensils this year. <laughs> Hell. Child, look. Fool around with this one. And call it grow. Mm-hmm. Baby, and you just smoothed it out heavy. Have you, I ain't about to sit here. This this, this pie gonna be what it is. It ain't, it ain't gonna be perfect. But you know, if you wanna smooth it out, if you wanna have you a little pattern, baby, just do, you do you, boo-boo. And I'ma do me. But if y'all see my pie, it may not be all the way flat, but one thing it's gonna do is it's gonna taste good, okay? Mm-hmm. 
Child, that's fine. It'll be all right. That's fine. It's, it's character. Character. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm going to say this little bit for me, because... I have some of it. I can't never have nothing to myself. <laughs> uh, I, I'll share. I'll be nice. I'll be nice. I'm just going to sit that to the side. Give me a corner. All right, y'all. So, uh, I always bake my pies on a pan or something. My mama always does. So, I bake it on a pan. Um, <clears throat> just, I mean, depending on the pie, it could be so it don't spill over. For this pie, I, I guess maybe it helps it bake more even. I don't know. This is what mama do, and I'm not going to mess with what mama do. But, as I've said, we have the oven preheated to 350 degrees. So, you're going to put these on the top shelf. Um, of your oven, we're gonna let it bake for an hour. Sometimes we need to go for a little bit longer depending on the color, because you know that crust gotta be nice and crisp. If we don't want it burnt, mm -hmm. I don't want no burnt crust. Cause y'all not gonna be saying the MD Takeover uh, came and served some some burnt crust pie, cause we not. Mm -hmm. So yeah, so we're gonna come just follow me. We're gonna put this in the oven. Follow me, camera. Mm -hmm. On that top shelf, I'm gonna set my timer for an hour. And then this, that's gonna be all she wrote, baby. We're gonna have us some nice sweet potato pies, and then you're gonna be ready for the holidays, cause we're gonna have y'all ready. By the time y'all done watching this, y'all gonna make your Thanksgiving meal, your Hanukkah meal, your Christmas meal, your your your, your, your Kwanzaa. You be ready for New Year's. Well, I don't know about New Year's, cause I don't I don't cook black eyed peas and cabbage. Chat who on me? We had chicken and red beans. <laughs> <laughs> Not the after church meal. <laughs> all right, but y'all, uh, we are gonna see y'all back in hour. I'm gonna sit here and um. Finish the, the, the rest of this here. I guess I'll share with Maya. How feeling? And we're gonna see y'all when it's done. I ain't said okay. eat it all. Fine. All right, y'all. So we're back. It's been it's been longer than an hour. I had to put it back on for 10 minutes. So it's been an hour and 10 minutes, and the pies are done. So we're gonna take what the oven. First off, let's get into it. Mm. Got a little crust on top, and then it's gonna settle down. Yes. All right, guys. So that's it. You have our sweet potato pies. Like I said, this is Mom's recipe, and that's it. I mean, been a be the For real. I mean, I just took them off the pan to let them cool. And then once they cool, you know, if you make it into the day of, then you could slice into them and enjoy. Um, besides that, once they're like, if you're, so you're gonna have them for a couple of days and they're not gonna be done, I would just put it in the refrigerator because the shelf life will be longer. And yeah, that's it. Real simple, real easy, very flavorful. You're not gonna be disappointed. Your guests will not be disappointed with this recipe. So if y'all try it, Make sure y'all uh, leave a comment and let us know how y'all like the recipe. And that's it. Yep. But before we end this video, make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a yes. friend, tell another friend yes. about the takeover yes. game yes. and what we got going on over here. And tune back in for the rest of our holiday special. This is uh, this is our first episode of our holiday series. So you don't want to miss it. So we're going to see y'all again. Happy Thanksgiving and happy holidays. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving.